The main thing that we saw that you were doing in your takeaway was you was having a tendency to really fan and roll the club face open. All right, so as you swing him back, the club face was almost pointing to the sky. All right, uh, and this was really coming from your right hand sort of rolling this way. So you're adding in forearm rotation before you've even started. All right, the best way to cure this is, the, I've done videos on this before, is to feel as though the right hand works in a backwards motion like so. So it's working this way, uh, and this will take away any of the uh, elements of rolling. You want to feel like the club face or the hand goes back this way. So as you're taking it back, it works back on itself. This will keep the club face looking a bit more down to the ground as you're swinging it back. All right, and then I want you, as you take the club back, to feel as though you're keeping that palm facing towards or away from you. Okay, from this direction that way, uh, all the way up to the top. The, the arm will rotate in the shoulder, but that's what gives you the the correct position. But for most of it, I want it to feel like you're going back, almost as though you're keeping it to the ground, and then the for, the for, the arm rotation in the shoulder socket will then take over. So here to here. All right, so you'll go from, uh, again, you'll go from the, this position where you've been rolling it inside, getting the club face open. I want you to feel as though you're taking it back with the club face working like so. So you just feel like you're really just sort of taking it back and through. All right, you can hit shots doing this again, gradually build up to it. Don't go at it at 100.